What I've just seen today is just absolutely phenomenal. It's a wonderful story for me to bring back both to uh, the president as well as to the secretary of education to really share your total commitment to Meriden's children. It's just, I can't say enough of, of words of praise to all of you for what you're doing. All of us who have been parents know that we lead by example. It's not just our words. In fact, even more than our words, it's our actions. With our extra 90 minutes a day, we wanted to make it fun and engaging for the students. So we thought about what could we do with the students with this extra time that made it fun and engaging. So we decided on healthy living. You can visually see this is how much sugar is in this whole bottle. So that's a lot of sugar. We're here at our first annual invention convention. Students as part of their science class all had to come up with inventions. Tonight was our first Parent Pasta open house here at Washington Middle School. So we had over 700 people here tonight. We're here on a Saturday morning for the enrichment program. Um, my son actually enjoyed coming here and was very excited after the first day. The last thing I'll leave you with that we're very excited is that we just start, well actually we're wrapping up what's called One School, One Book, which has been done at the elementary level before, but we're doing it here at the secondary level. Just finished four fabulous weeks of our enrichment program for all of our students here at Israel Putnam. Ms. Weil is part of our Leadership Academy here in Meriden, and this is one of her projects that she's doing this year. At a time when we're short on resources, we need to be more ingenious and creative and innovative than ever before and the ingenuity and creativity in this classroom is what should inspire our nation as well as our state. And I, I just really want to thank you from the bottom of my heart for caring so much about kids and for offering them hope which is the greatest gift that we can give to all of our children. So thank you so much.